Jim Osborne has spent much of his life acquiring hundreds of items that tell the story of America's armed forces going back hundreds of years. Many of those filled this room at the Indiana Military Museum. But Osborne says there is plenty of history that's currently sitting in storage. A lot of artifacts that we've been building up that don't have a place to exhibit. We knew we needed to expand it. The museum is one step closer to that expansion thanks to a $100,000 grant from Vincent City Council. Council President Brian Grove says it was a substantial ask, but one the city knew they wanted to fulfill. The War Museum is a dedicated destination spot, and w with it, you know, it, it has a huge draw. So, um, yes, it was a lot, um, but we have we have a fund for grant match program. As Grove mentioned, these dollars will go towards a $250,000 matching grant with the state. This will allow the museum to nearly double its exhibit space and add a 50-person theater to its annex building. As for what will go into the new area, Osborne says there's more than he can count. Well, on and on and on. Yeah. I could name I could name a hundred other things. And he thanked the dozens of volunteers who helped the organization as well as the community for showing support. And he says he wants to see the museum continue to flourish well into the future. Military history is continually evolving, so we will never stop acquiring more items. We'll never stop making new exhibits that talk about the current matters, and, and that will never end.